How to create instructional videos using SlideTalk. Brought to you by SlideTalk.net. To create and share an instructional video using SlideTalk, you need to follow three steps. First, you need to build your presentation in PowerPoint. Then, you need to import the presentation into SlideTalk and add a voiceover. To create the voiceover, you only need to type a text for each slide. Slide Talk will provide the magic that converts your text into speech and your slides into a video. Finally, once the video has been published on YouTube, you can share it or embed it on your blog or website. Please note that this video itself has been created using this method, and the voiceover that you are hearing was created using text to speech from Slide Talk. Let's now dig deeper into each step. Starting with some suggestions on how to build your instructional slides and your PowerPoint presentation. Widescreen format fits the YouTube video format perfectly, so start by setting your PowerPoint presentations to widescreen. When building instructional videos you need to provide pictures, and in some case also screenshots. With PowerPoint it's quite easy to add screenshots to the presentation by using the screenshot command. You can also use the crop command to keep only the part of the image which is most relevant for your instructional goals. PowerPoint also makes it easy to add shapes like the boxes used in this presentation or arrows as in the example in this slide. These shapes may be used to focus the audience on the most important details of your slides. With the help of your visual content and these tips, you can now build the PowerPoint presentation for your instructional video, guiding your audience into your subject, step by step. At this point let's look at how to import the PowerPoint presentation into SlideTalk, and add a voiceover. Open SlideTalk.net in your browser and login. Click on Create to start a new Slide Talk project. Provide a title, choose the default narrating voice, and then click on Create Slide Talk. You can also use several voices in a presentation, as in the example you are hearing now. Check the Slide Talk FAQ to learn how to switch voice and language, and how to control other text to speech settings. Locate the option to add a complete PowerPoint presentation. Select it and point to the PowerPoint file on your computer, and then wait until Slide Talk has finished importing and processing the file. When import is finished, you will see all your slides in the edit page, and you can start typing comments in the text boxes near each slide. You can use the Listen to the Text button below the slides to hear how your text will be rendered by the text-to-speech. The Save button at the bottom of the page can be used at any time to save your work. After your work has been saved, you can watch a preview of your video, and then continue editing to improve the text comments. Once you have entered all your comments and you are satisfied with the preview of the video, you can click on Produce Now to get the Slide Talk video processed and posted on YouTube. You will be notified by email when the video is ready and published. The email notification will include a link to the video on YouTube. At this point you already have got a link to your video on YouTube. The link may be shared with your audience via email, Facebook. Twitter, a link on your website, or via other social medias. However YouTube offer even more sharing options. This is how the YouTube page of your video may look like. Notice the share section under the video. In the share section you will see the embed command, providing you with some HTML code that you can include on your website, to allow your audience to enjoy your instructional video without leaving your website. So let's resume what we have learned. To create an instructional video with Slide Talk, you need first to prepare a PowerPoint presentation, including your visual content like slides, pictures, screenshots, and highlights. 
Import the PowerPoint presentation into Slide Talk to add a voiceover to the slides, with help of text to speech. The PowerPoint presentation will then be automatically converted into a video and published on YouTube. Once your instructional video is published on YouTube, you are ready to share it with your audience or embed it on your website. You have been watching How to Create Instructional Videos Using Slide Talk. Brought to you by SlideTalk.net.